Dude. Best week show ever. five of the 2023 season. Best show ever, man. Best show ever. Just as simple Best as that. Best show, show ever. Ever. Dude. Oh, buddy. Oh, man. Bring Dude. it. Bring Dude. it. Let's go. You're back. Man, you I, are I, back. I don't know what you're doing. You Carl keep, is back. I keep hearing that, and I'm like, I haven't gone to... I'm, been, I haven't been 500. I've been right there every week. Actually, you, know? you have. We're due to ready to. I mean, I'm actually. So, have you been like tweaking? Are you been down in the basement oh. where there's lights flashing every, and all this? Every there's stuff week, we've got the flying. algorithm putting in the new data points, <laughs> tweaking that thing. We're getting it right. I think we're we lined up for another. <laughs> listen, listen. It reminds me uh, of a quote. What's what's the philosopher? What's his name? What's what's his name? Um, S- Doug so- <laughs> Socrates, right? Socrates. Socrates. Yeah, right. He All said right. he said one time that the first four weeks of an NFL season, <laughs> the only thing I know is I know nothing. <laughs> right? Yeah. And then week five. And then you start. You get week five. Points. That's right. Now we know everything. <laughs> and then, now. Now we know everything. Four <laughs> weeks down, the guys. <laughs> have a seat. Have a cup of coffee. Watch the show because we are about to deliver you some winners. Winners. Right. That's, right. That's, That's, That's right. That's what we're about. We're about winners. All right. Hey, you've got Carl. You've got Doug. You've got Firebird Sports. It is week five. And of the now we know season. everything. And now we know Finally. everything. Okay. Oh, we've been waiting for this. All right. Well, let's talk about what we do know. Um, our records last week. Yeah. Okay. You finally got back. Finally got back. I should have had 11 and 5. Actually, I thought you were looking at like 12. At one point, it looked like you were trending towards 12. Hey, 10 and 6. You have just quietly, just slowly but surely advanced. (laughs) Just just moving right along there, dude. At the end of the day, Um, Carl from Fire and Brim will be at the top of the show. <laughs> we know where I'll be. <laughs> uh, and I'm doing it for everybody. I'm you are. You guys, it's not a are. secret. You My are. picks aren't secret. No Changing secrets them here. up until the last. Listen, on Wednesday, I'm putting up there with the knowledge that we have <laughs> at this moment, the information that we have right now. Yeah. We are making our picks today, and we don't get to change them up to game That's, time. I, I tell you what. What hurt me by seven and nine? Um, I picked the Browns and Deshaun Watson. It doesn't end up playing right at the last yeah, minute. Um, uh, Grappolo doesn't play for the Raiders. I mean, yeah, it was I after we Raiders. did it. Yeah, and so Mahomes slides. Mahomes <laughs> slides. It's right. Yeah, I watched watch that. Go, 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 and he slides. Yeah. No, that is a tough part about this because we whatever we pick is what we pick. That's what we go for. Yeah, I say all so, the time too. They, all those buildings. Out in Vegas, they didn't build those up the winners. <laughs> they didn't build those up. No, they didn't. Hey, Miami Dole Puns, 9 and 7. He is nice week for a right guest picker. Ping is yeah. too. I screwed up in the Kool Aid pick. I mean, you just you just rode my rear end about that last week by picking the uh, Broncos. They, they, and, and, oh, the Bears led that game 28 to 7. The Bears led that game. Who's worse? I, I suppose we'll find out on Thursday night. Well, here's the thing the whole point was let's not take. <laughs> Two bad teams and pick one to cover a spread. That's all. Yeah, that's, that's all. Okay. That's all. Listen. It can be fundamental, right? Okay. <laughs> hey, so um, look at it. Bill's Mafia is back. 12 and 4. Look at the 12 and 4s. Now, listen, Bill's Mafia is not not just Bill's Mafia. Yeah. Bill's Mafia is back. Yes, right? yes. The that's Bills right. Bills are for real. Um, uh, Grey Goose, Doghouse, Bears. I mean, Brady Breeze picks. I mean, um, a la Broncos. I mean, all of these folks. These look are at those solid numbers. Picks. Those these are, are solid these picks. Are, these are, I. These guys, these are handicappers. These guys Absolutely. are solid handicappers. They know what they're doing. They put their picks out there for people to see. Absolutely. And they pick winners every week. I mean, um, so we have a, an awesome community. Look, let's look at the overall. Okay, you are starting to get up the leaderboard. Actually, we're on the second page. But a la Broncos takes the lead. He has a heck of a week. So you know what? We're going to put in the jinx for a la Broncos. And he is the guest picker on this week's board. <laughs> Welcome, all our Broncos. He's the overall leader. We've got to get the guest picker guest picker jinx going. Yeah, here. absolutely. There we go. Tua has held off. He was a guest picker. I mean, so yeah, a lot of uh, sports boys is still in there. Derek Carr, Gene Panici, everybody. Uh, we are on page two of the board. Uh, I will say you, Ping, and I are all. We're all on page two of the board. So. We're above 500, that's what counts, and uh, you are rising nice and slowly up the board. 
Uh, methodically, I would say, and that's what you get yeah. for all the data that you have. Yeah, listen, the algorithm is, in, is intact, <laughs> except it did not like the three team. It did like week. the three this team. This is very really rare for us to go one. Oh out of three my gosh, left, Dan so. Campbell, Shrek the Ogre, nice job. Oh, Miami Dope Punch, four weeks, three weeks. He hits the three-team parlay. I got my eye on Miami Dolphins' picks. <laughs> I got my eye on his picks. Dude, absolutely Listen. rocking it. That yep. is, how do you do that? I don't know. I mean, it's hard enough to just do it once. Uh, survivor pick. Ping and I are still around, the Chiefs and that. the Chargers. I mean, getting, it's getting dicey I'm now. I'm glad we finally just took me off of the Chiefs. <laughs> I thought you asked last just week. Just take me off. Just, yeah. just don't do that. Do that. So I listened to what you said. Hey, uh, last week, we did lose three people. We started with 18, lost three. The Bengals and the Steelers were the ones that really hurt a lot of people. And uh, we have 15 people out of 52 left. Okay. That is not too bad. Yep. That's not too bad at all. Yes, okay. Is. You want to talk about top five again? Who are we liking? I always send you I that text. You yeah. I always send you that text. Okay, what do you think about the top five? And so, here you go. There's your top five. Here's my top five. I have a hard time with this now because... Before I was talking about everybody after two was the yeah same. yeah but last these week. top three I don't know like I called first of all I completely underestimated the 49ers at the yeah. beginning of the year I yeah. said that yeah. they are I don't know if they're beatable they're just yeah. they just look amazing Cowboys defense looks amazing they had the blood the, the the stumble against Arizona division road game that you played to the level of your competition no big deal but Buffalo since week Buffalo one Buffalo's coming on. I retract on. my statement about Ooh, Josh Allen wow. being a liability. Ooh, wow. I retract that. I am back on the Buffalo bandwagon. I am back on Bills Mafia. <laughs> Listen, they are beating people. The Dolphins, I still got to keep in there because, the, I mean. Okay, where are the Eagles? Teams. You don't have the Eagles. No, and, 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 and the Eagles are what? One of two? One of the two? Yeah, they're the um, Eagles and the 49ers. Yeah. They're the other 15. And, and I don't have the Eagles in my top six. Yeah, and, and the reason yeah. I. I've just seen some weaknesses on the Eagles. I don't know. Okay. We're going to see. We're going to find out when they play Dallas. We're going to find out when they play some of these teams. But I still think the loss of the coordinators has hurt Philly. I think they've won some games. They've won some yeah. close games. Yeah. yeah. And when it gets into the heat of it, they're not in my top six. Um, the and Lions, you prominently... And they are the not going to win that division. If you think... If you think Philadelphia is winning you that division, the Cowboys. they are. You Dallas, think the Giants. Is, Dallas is winning that division. <laughs> Dallas, I'm just telling you right now. Uh, well, it's going to be they have a Dallas. Yeah, absolutely, coming down to that. I like the Lions. I like the Lions call on that one. Uh, I don't have the Lions that high up. I've got the Eagles up there instead. Well, that's because you're wrong. But because <laughs> see, because see, D Detroit 100% belongs there. They've played two amazing, great, fantastic, solid football games, top to bottom, yeah. since the loss of Seattle. Yeah. The, every facet of the game. They are they are hitting on all cylinders. They got a big lead, and you know what teams can't do in the NFL? Close they it. They a lead. Close it. That's right. Close it. They've been they've been closing <coughs> it out. And the Lions did that every time and Green Bay tried to answer. The Lions just answered and right back. You called it when they lost to the Seahawks. You said that's a good loss. That was the loss, but they needed. Yeah, that was the they, perfect loss they needed. They quit drinking the Kool Aid and they're playing Let's football. Get to work, yeah. They're playing football and they're getting work. Absolutely. So we want to hear your top five. Everybody's giving the top five. Of course, it changes every week, but except I think most people are all saying San Francisco. Okay, you know Chiefs, Eagles. Yeah, yeah uh, those are you know, yeah. Bills. Yep. You're right about the Bills. They are coming on. They're coming. On. Maybe that first game against the Jets. Was kind of their, their, their good the loss, yeah. you know, and same sort of thing. Yeah. I mean, they, Allen couldn't have played that. worse that game, and and he's been fantastic. Are there any teams that they should be a time for panic? Is there any you teams? Know, that I don't know. I, the, the Bengals, what about the Bengals? The Bengals what started the Bengals? one and two last year. The, Is it time I, to panic? I don't. Is it time I mean, to? I don't think so. I well, I mean, you don't want to go one and four. No, no, you don't um, want to do that. I mean, I they're the only ones I could think of. I mean. All the other teams. Everybody's like, right in the hunt, right? My Raiders, they're not. They're bad. Yeah. They're, they're just bad. So, I mean, there's no panic because they're not anything to panic yeah. about. The Bears they're didn't have good. any expectations. That's right. There's no expectation. The only one I can think of is really the Bengals. That is, uh, you know, it, you said the perfect word, expectation yeah. right there. Yeah. All right. Let's do it, dude. Let's go, man. Brown bag, man. Okay. Yeah, brown bag. Oh, we... You know. Uh, what are you going to do, do with do, the brown bag? Do, do you pile on some teams? Do you, what do you... What do, you, what do you do with the brown bag? You, you go ahead. You start with the brown bag. So I'm going with, what don't I see in there? The Giants? Oh, no, the you Bears? got it up there. You got it over there. There, there you go. All right. 
You're gonna go with the Bears. I fumbled. It's a live show. <laughs> fumbled the ball. We don't edit this. This is a one We don't take edit show. this. <laughs> That's why he's standing there going, huh, I think it's right over there, dude. The Bears. Listen, here's the deal with the Bears. No expectations, right? But guess what? You had Justin Fields yeah. clicking. Yeah. You had the offense clicking. Yeah. You had a 28 to 7 lead in front yeah. of your home fans who are still showing up despite the garbage. Yeah. And you just imploded yeah. and Absolutely. lost to Denver. So. Sorry, sorry, Mark. I got a good friend, Mark, who's yeah. a big Bears fan. Sorry, dude. We're not piling on. We're not doing. I'm not piling on. on. <laughs> I'm gonna tell you, in a daily fantasy league yeah. uh, that I'm in, I had Justin Fields as my starting quarterback. I Are had him. Pick, yeah, Justin Fields and Dart and, and Moore and DJ Moore. Yep. I pick CJ Stroud instead. Yep. <laughs> Whoever's got CJ Stroud. I'm just saying that That's the, a the daily we pick. You pick a new team yeah. every week. But yeah, this week I had Fields, so I was all about it. So and I had the Bears to cover, which they did cover, which is all we care about. I'm going to pile on sort of expectations, go with the Giants. Yeah. It's sort of the same sort of scenario. You've got, okay, you supposedly have a quarterback. you got the running game. you got this, this, this awesome head coach. You know, I mean, all the pieces and parts there, right? They were outperformed last year. Oh my they gosh. were outperformed oh, yeah. last year, is what it was. They oh, just yeah. played above their, you know, their weight. Mm -hmm. They're punching above the weight, and it's showing up right now. Yeah, is what it, it is. Really is. Same as Minnesota. Same right. as Minnesota. Absolutely. Yeah. Yep. Absolutely. So, so. Um, I think we get into week five. Then. Let's do it. Uh, let's, let's just get it because I've got so we got some winners. Okay. Um, just so everybody know for especially for fantasy. Browns, the Buccaneers, the Chargers, and the Seahawks are in the bye. The bye is now started, so we only have 14 games this week. And it starts out... Before we give go, go. our picks for free to free. you... Free, that's right. Every single week. Free. <laughs> you can scroll and see all of our winning picks every free. single week. <laughs> go ahead. If you haven't already, you should have subscribed by now because I know you fast-forwarded to this Thank you for point. doing that. You're right you here, that. right now. Absolutely. Please hit subscribe um, because then you'll get this every single week. And you can fast-forward to this part yep, and yep. see us make our picks. Absolutely. And then you're good. All right. I've got this goal. I want to get to 1,000 subscribers. We should be there after this week. We should be there after this week. Everybody please comment. Please tell people about yeah. it. Yeah, I know. Please tell people about well, it, Joe. Yeah. Yeah, it's like, subscribe. We really would appreciate that. Listen, our it's very first, right our there. very first comment ever. Ever. <laughs> I don't even remember it. Yeah. It's like, this is the worst show, show ever, ever. ever. Oh, that's why he said best show ever. <laughs> He's like, this is literally the worst thing I've ever watched in my life. It was our very first yeah, comment. Very first, first comment. comment. <laughs> We're still here. <laughs> we are. All I do is pick, all we do is pick winners. Okay, here is some of it's still here. The Bears, Justin Fields, take on Sam Howell in Washington, Thursday night football. He's had some good games. <laughs> <laughs> Washington by six and a half. Yeah. Wait, okay, it, it just, go, go. I want to hear what you say about this one. L the Bears were very close to getting their first win. They there. were. Okay. They were. And there they is were. a level of, Washington is not the a quality of a team to just go out and cover spreads. They're playing well. They're Powell's playing, playing well. well. They're playing it's well. It's a primetime game. This is a chance for Fields to show out on primetime. Yeah. He yep. had things clicking last week. Yep. They're going to be in this ball game. I could see them winning this ball game. Okay. I can see a Chicago money line. Um, all out Broncos. He's going with Washington, and you know what? I am going to go with Washington. Well, you know they're the favorite. So I, well, there's a reason they're a six and a half point favorite. I believe that Sam Howell and Eric Bieniemy coming from the Chiefs. I they're think that's clicking. meshing right mm -hmm. now, and they've got their defense is really starting to pick up as yeah. well. Yeah, no, no, that's, I like it. That's why I, I really liked them against the Eagles last week. I had, but yeah, you did. But they that's played right. a very emotional game at a very high level. Yeah. Can they carry that over to a playing not a good team? We're going to see tomorrow night. We're going to see how there's a night. That is a real thing. Okay. We're going back to England here. Jaguars, nice job against the Falcons last week. Take on the Bills. Or you said our starters <coughs> is rumble. The Bills are starting mm -hmm. to rumble. Mm -hmm. Bills by five and a half. Okay. Yeah. Bills got the long plane flight flying across the, you know, the other side of um, the Atlantic. Jacksonville has stayed in England the whole time. They have two weeks in a row. They're in England. I get to give a little bit of advantage there to uh, you know the Jaguars. You I'm love the go, Jaguars, don't you? I'm going to go the Jaguars. You really I'm can't. Go the Jaguars. You what, what is it about the Jaguars that you just love so much? You love Trevor Lawrence. <laughs> you love the Jaguars. <laughs> like, oh, they're so good. Did you pick them to win the division too? I think it's going to be well inside that five and a half. I think the Jaguars well could even win. I think the Jaguars could win the game. Actually, I, I'm telling you, I think they could win the game. 
Well, the Bills are going to have jet lag. I'm, and yeah, yeah, I'm going to tell you what the algorithm said. Okay. <laughs> tell me. Tell me what the algorithm says. The fact that they've been there for two weeks. The yeah. fact that Buffalo is also coming yeah. off a very emotional Emotional? Game. Emo Josh game. Allen Big is game. playing great. Yep. I do not want to take this. Do not take this wrong, Bills Mafia. Yeah. Do not take this wrong. But I am going to go with Jacksonville <laughs> to cover this game. I am going to go with Jacksonville to cover this game. I think it's the right pick. And uh, Bills will they'll be right back on track. They, they'll win this game. They'll be right back oh, on yeah. track. Oh, yeah. I don't think it, it knacks the Bills off the rails. Nope, I'm just right saying this on. game yep. is, is set up for the Jaguars. Right. Absolutely. Okay. Texans. CJ Stroud. What do you want to say about CJ Stroud? How about Nico Collins? Oh, my. <laughs> Nico Collins. Nico <laughs> Collins. The Ohio State quarterback making the Michigan wide receiver look really, really good. Okay. Or is it the other way right. around? Yeah. It could be the other way around. Okay. They, they, no, got, a, they got a good thing going. You got to say, though. The kid's impressive. He looks like an NFL quarterback. You know what? He doesn't want to run either. He wants to stand in the pocket and throw. He's throwing the ball. Okay, Desmond Ritter. I mean, what do you say about the Falcons? I can't believe this is one and a half. I can't that, believe it either. I can't believe this is so easy. This one is so easy. <laughs> All you have to say is... Who <laughs> wants I say so easy? <laughs> so easy. I can't believe it. <laughs> <laughs> Not a chance. Yeah. That's all you have to say to know that Atlanta is going to win this football game. Actually, like every week, right. the first line you see when you go, what? No, that's the one you're going to lose. Yeah, okay. I, so, I must admit, I do yeah. <laughs> I do, do that. All right. Um, all out, he's going with you, man. He's, it, remember, he's in the lead he's, overall. He's a professional handicap. So he's he knows a professional. What he's doing. Absolutely. Yeah. Okay. I like this matchup. Yeah. NFC South defense, or yeah. AFC South matchup. Big one. The Titans take on the Colts. Colts by one and a half. This is really, I mean, mm. Jonathan I Taylor is, I don't think he's, he's going to play. I don't think he's going to play. Yeah, it doesn't matter. Listen, play. Anthony, they, they came back from 23 nothing down to tie that game. Yeah, yeah. Anthony Richardson's playing just as well. It could be a battle between him and Stroud for rookie of the year. I was calling Anthony Richardson rookie of the year, beginning of the year. You were telling me how he's the worst quarterback in the league, Anthony Richardson. I'm going to go with course. the Titans. I picked a dog. Mm -hmm. I picked a dog. Yeah, don't I get some? Yeah, don't I job. get some? You, you know, pick, coverage here. You know, <laughs> <laughs> right, a losing dog. Right. Okay, you picked Jacksonville. Good pick. Way to go. I didn't like it. Good job. All right, the Ravens take on Kenny Pickett and the Steelers. Ravens by four and a half. Kenny Pickett has not been looking good. Mm -hmm. The Steelers have been what? They're two and two, mm -hmm. but it's an ugly looking two and two. But that's all Mike Tomlin. I mean, that's because of Mike Tomlin. Yeah. Um, who do you like? I want to see who you're picking the up. The Mike story. Tomlin play. Listen, all you got to do is look up all the numbers on yeah. Steelers against the spread, Steelers at home after a loss, Steelers with Mike Tomlin against Baltimore. All the, yeah. any, any metric you want to look at, Pittsburgh covers this this game. All right. All Out is going with you, and I'm still making my decision right he now. Knows, so I'm he knows at what it. he's doing. Mm, and I'm making my decision. You know what? Forget it. I, I'm going to go, yes, I'm taking the, I'm taking the favorite. Mock me. Good Mock me. Not, Tell me about you. Listen, I want you to get some. <laughs> this, one of us is going to be. To, uh, with, All right. I'm okay. I'm not. Uh, the Saints, we're not sure about Derek Carr. He, he shouldn't have played last week. He looked horrible last week. He was playing injured. There's a difference between playing hurt and playing injured. He was clearly injured. Um, Taking on the Patriots, who the whole team was injured last week. Uh, I mean, they were just. They were banged up. Ugly. I mean. But Patriots by one and a half. Yeah, Patriots come home. How do you pick that one? You pick the Patriots. To, you pick the team that's going to win the game, and it's going to be the Patriots. You think so? Yeah, because the Saints, their defense isn't all I thought it was going to be. Yeah. Um, I saw a couple games where I'm like, hey, these guys look for real. They're they're really not that great. Um, the Patriots are going to win this football game. I'm going to take the dog, and I'm going to go to the this Saints. One, this one, I don't know. This one, the Patriots are winning this football game. You think so? Yeah. You think so? Okay. But you can put the Patriots <laughs> Dude, I'm picking another dog. I'm yeah, picking a dog. I mean, come on. Jeez. Proud of you. Tell me, what do you guys think? Should I pick the it's dog? Like the, the no, I think the going Saints. Going right now with Mr. Rogers. I hope you know I'm proud of you. I'm no. really proud of you. Uh, these I guys, you know they, they, they will win the game. They, they've got enough firepower to win the game. <laughs> Absolutely. Okay, Giants. Playing horrible. God, they're Take so on bad. these the Dolphins. They are so Ooh. bad. Okay. Dolphins by nine and a half. All right, let's just uh, okay. Uh, let's read. All out said Giants. He's going to go with the Giants. 
That surprised me. You know what? This is a snapback game. The Dolphins have to fin slap somebody, and who's going to get fin slapped is going to be the Please Giants. Don't like this, the pick. And I am going Please with. Don't no, like it's, this, not the the pick. Pick. it's not the Kool Aid pick. It's not the Kool Aid pick. It's not the Kool Aid pick. No, I think that the Dolphins, they, they want to get back. Remember the good loss scenario? Mm -hmm. Last week was a good loss. That was not a good loss. Actually, that it was, was a, a good division. Loss. It was a rival. divisional rival. But okay, but it was a, it was a loss, loss, and yeah. they're going to learn from that, and then they're going to fin slap the Giants. I cannot believe how bad they are. They're bad. I just cannot believe Horrible. that they're that bad. Um, they, this game's already pushed to 10, 11 out in the markets. Like as it it's, should be. Yeah, yep, as it's it already pushed be. to Absolutely. that. Absolutely. Under 10. I'm going to go ahead and take the Dolphins to call. Oh! Anything. Ooh. 11, 12. I mean, I'm not taking this game. I yeah. won't be playing this game. It won't be one of my picks. I'm going to take the Dolphins under 10. Once you cross that threshold, I'm probably looking at the Giants. Okay. I'm going right. to go with the Dolphins minus that. I like it. You want to move that so you don't want to yeah, have let's to do that. jump all over? Okay. Here's a game. Here's a game right here. The Panthers. They're one of the two teams that are still winless this mm -hmm. year. The Bears and the Panthers are winless. Take on, I don't want to say resurgent. I mean, they're just they're starting to roll. Plains they're starting to roll. Plains Lions Sunday. by eight and a half. Yeah. I want to hear what you say about yeah. this. Go go for the it. The Lions are clicking here. on all cylinders. Yep. Okay. Yep. This is a win. All right. We're they're at home. Everything's clicking. The Lions will be four and one. I don't like eight and a half. I don't like nine and a half, um, which I've seen numbers of it go to. I'm going to take Carolina to fight in this game, because, and I want the Lions to keep that bite about them. I want them to get challenged yeah. by a team that they don't expect to be challenged by. NFL games don't just go 31 to 10 on a regular basis. Yeah. Like That's not what happens. Yeah. And the, most games are competitive and within one score, and this is one where Carolina maybe should surprise a little bit, but the Lions should pull it out, but I'm going to take Carolina. This this one worries me because of exactly what happened when Carolina was playing the Saints a couple weeks ago. I think week two it may have been. Saints had the game and there was a garbage touchdown at the very end. And you know Saints they pulled like within. That. It's hard the, to win by double digits. Yeah, it's hard to win by double digits. It really is. I, I know, I know, I know, I know. But mm. you don't. You still aren't getting it. No, You're I'm still not getting, not getting it. it. I'm going with the Lions. I'm going with the Lions and win big. I, if they're going to win by 10. The Lions are going to win by 10 in this one. There's just a, they're going to win. It would be odd win by 10. for you to not take. Like, listen, <laughs> last week I took. If there's one thing you know, I don't take yeah. double-digit favorites. So when I, I do, know that, I know you that, should yeah. be loaded up heavy on them. Yep, last yep, week yep. I took San Francisco <laughs> minus, what, 70? Yeah. This not happening. Uh, okay. All right. All right. It's I just. Happening. Anyway, the Lions win. And that's the thing. We'll that have to have another conversation about it. Do you understand? Are you getting it now? That this just does not happen on a regular basis. He schools basis. me during the, during the games on Sunday. I still I don't go on to Phoenix. That's, that's what I'm trying to say, too, is people come at me about one game, and I'm like, listen, I'm not trying to go 100, 372 and 0, all right? That's all not right. going to happen. All right. Eagles. It's like I made that comment on one. I was like, I lost 170 I know, games I know. last that's year. Right. Right? That's, like, right. Like, that's right. That's right. I lost 170 <laughs> games last year. I'm going to take my chances on this one. Uh, the Eagles take on the Rams. Rams are actually looking very good. Boy, Stafford. Um, Eagles, my four God, and a half. That's still my love for my Stafford. Are they, are these guys, you've been saying it, they've lost both coordinators, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and they're just not playing the same way. And You know, and I'm, I'm telling you what, I'm going to go with the Rams. I'm going to take the dog, and I'm going to go with the Rams. All out, he's going you know, with the Eagles. So who are you? you? All out watches. This guy knows what he's doing. <laughs> I just every week I watch his picks, and I'm like, man, this guy's good. This guy is good. <laughs> he's this good. guy is good. He's good. Because listen, here's what's going to happen here. Stafford is going to throw my beloved pick that I love so much <laughs> to keep him from covering this football game. Philadelphia wins and covers. Coming down, game-winning drive, Philly down by, the Rams down by six, down by seven. They're going to be driving down the field, and Stafford's <laughs> going to throw a pick to end the game, and Philly wins and covers. Okay. All right. No, I, this is going to be a fun game. Mm -hmm. This is going to be a fun game. Uh, but the Rams are going to, you know, at least they're going to win. They're going to win with the points. That's for sure. Okay. Is it time to panic? Burrow is not looking good. Taking out the Cardinals, who have the ability. They, they, they caught the Cowboys off guard. Bengals by three and a half. It's on the road. What we got a couple say? of things. What do you say, here? Swami? I have a lot of hust resentment. I'm a, I'm really upset yeah. with Arizona for not delivering me yeah. that survivor pick. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you are. You are. Okay. okay. 
Because they should have delivered it for yeah. me when everybody mocked me for picking it. It should have come through. Um, they have holes. They're not good. Um, the Bengals can't take anybody lightly right now. Yeah. And as soon as they have an opportunity to put it on somebody, it's going to happen. The Bengals will win and cover this game. Um, even if it's mostly, I mean, Burrow's going to continue to get healthy. I think the Bengals bounce back. I am with you, and so is all our Broncos. God, he's smart. We are, he we are, really, he's following whatever really, you're saying. That's right. He is really smart. <laughs> I don't understand this. That's a lot of points, so I do get it. So, I get it. I get it, all out Broncos. I mean, I'm, because it, really, if I'm saying that they'll cover 12, I should say that they'll cover nine and a half. Yeah. So I, he's really good. Okay. All right. Let's see how good you guys are on this one. It's going to be hard Jeez. to catch him. Take on the Vikings, Chiefs by five and a half. Mm -hmm. That's a I mean, points. that should. Mm, wow. Okay, uh, let's start out. All out is going with the Vikings. Who do you like? I need to hear what you're saying. <laughs> I want your assessment of this one. The Chiefs don't like to cover games. They don't like to cover no, games. No, they don't. No, they don't like to cover games. The Holmes likes to slide to prevent them from covering. I, I did look that up. The Vikings. The Vikings' loss has not been bad. They have been losing like average, maybe like four points. Right. That, that's about it. So they're they're not getting blown out by anybody, in any particular fashion. So who do you like? You like Chiefs? I'm gonna go with Mahomes and the Chiefs, just because the Vikings are just so terrible. You know what? I am gonna go with you on that too. In fact, I'm gonna go with you on that so much. It is the Kool Aid pick of the week. Yeah. You you're not gonna lambast no, me or anything that. like that. I can okay. Buy that. Drink the Kool-Aid. we got to get one right. There it is. There it is. The Chiefs. Yeah, the Kool-Aid pick. This is our lock signature pick of the week. If, you're, if you fast forward <laughs> to this point, you don't know what's going on. You're watching this man drink some Kool-Aid. Doug's drinking the Kool-Aid because that's his lock Kool-Aid pick of the, week. of the week. That's right. Okay. Here's a lock. So all our Broncos missed one. Yeah, he did one. <laughs> Jets, take on the Broncos. Broncos by two and a half. I mean, what do you say about the Broncos? I mean, they, they finally win a game, but they beat the Bears. I mean... These guys showed some heart. They they showed us something last week. They did. I mean, they they they, they played showed well it enough that they're still not very good. Uh, and they, they Denver do does that. have a head coach, so something should start to click here soon. We're going to go Broncos to win this game at Mile High. You know what? Um, all out's going with the Jets. I'm going to follow suit with you on that, and I'm going to go with the Broncos as well. I, just because of what you just said. Eventually, it's going to click. It's mile high. It's at altitude and all that. There's a lot of variables there. Mm -hmm. um, I think that uh, these guys can actually do it for this game. Premier game of the week right yep. here. Cowboys take on the 49ers. 49ers by three and a half. That's about right. It's home field advantage <laughs> for the 49ers, I love right? watching the Cowboys and the Niners play, right? Yeah. <laughs> it's like taking us back to the 90s. This is, uh, it is, it is, uh, that's right. Yeah. Is a, a Joe Montana You're type of game. covering three and a half. All out. Is saying, yeah, they're, yep, they're not the... covering three and a half. <sighs> no, this I'm game's going to be decided on a field goal, either side of the ball. I'm going to go with them. Okay. I'm going to go. It's home field advantage. You're going to win by four. Okay. At least four. 24 20. 30 26. Yep. It doesn't matter. Yep. They're, they're going right. to win. Okay. Packers, take on my Raiders. We're not sure about Jimmy G. Mm -hmm. Actually, it doesn't matter, even if we know Jimmy G is playing. Um, but you know what? Even if he doesn't play, I liked what Aiden O'Connell did last yeah, week. I liked the, the way the that kid game. looked. And I'll take those points. All out saying the Packers. So we have some changes Listen, there for a change. All out. This guy's a tough competition. He's good. He really He's is. Good. He's good. He's, good. He's really good. Take okay. him serious. Let's, we got all that. We need to oh, know sure what you guys like. Go. Okay. Yeah. Carol, sweet team parlay. Go. Quick. Cincinnati is covering Cincinnati. that game. Bengals. I am going with... The Atlanta Falcons, Falcons, which is a surprise to put in my three-team parlay, but I like it, and I like Pittsburgh. There you go. The data shows Pittsburgh's going to Falcons, cover. Pittsburgh, Cincinnati. Cincinnati. I like it. I like it. Okay. I am still alive in Survivor, and I'm going to go with, absolutely, I'm going to go with the Lions. Awesome. I'm going to take those Lions, and I'm going to get that. All right. Stick around Let's for week go. six. Absolutely. All, All right. right. Man, we are good. This we is got fun. It. This Let's is fun. We I did know. it. We did it. Like, subscribe. This is it. Let's get That's out. That's right. There. Like, subscribe. We'll get it on YouTube, Twitter, you know, Facebook. We'll do our little TikTok as well. Let's do it. And it's going to be fun. Tell us who you like this week. You know, Man. give us your comments. It's Share. a serious handicapping show, guys. Absolutely. Subscribe. Hey, pick some winners. All right. You will see ya. Bye.